Hi everyone, I'm Ben Tommy from Norway. I hope you understand my Kibrok in English. Uh, I'm trying to show you how to make some more simple running water in Lightwave. The first thing I do is to generate the water. I use item, uh, dynamic object and particles. I record the water and I use HV emitter. Uh, here I can adjust a lot of things. I'm not going to do uh, anything here at the moment. The next object I'm going to uh, add is uh, a collision object. Um, I just call it collision. And the first collision object I want is a plane. Can I move it down a little bit? Just so the water can uh, go anywhere. I adjust the camera and nothing happened. Because uh, we uh, would need some gravity to push uh, the water. I'm going to increase the size of the gravity and increase the forces. Where I live it's uh, 9 point... sorry... 9.81 You see the water, I try to select it. You will now see the water is running. But if I now try to render this, nothing happened. And the reason for that is I haven't activated yet. Uh, I need to go to Windows, Volumetrics, Fogs and Options. And here I need Hyper Voxels. I double click on that and select water and activate it. Now we try to render and we see something is happening. Um, but that doesn't look like water, so I'm going to shade it and try to make some water fast. The color of water is nothing, so I set it to black. Specularity is high on water, glossiness is also very high, uh, reflection set to about 36% and transparency something like that. Now I try to render. It seems like nothing happened, but if I now try to go to uh, backdrop option and add some backdrop. I personally like uh, Sky Trace 2 and I try to render it. Now it looks a lot more like water. Uh, if I uh, uh, render more, I can retrace shadow, retrace transparency. I don't think so. Reflection and refraction. I forget to keep the water in the re refraction. But now I try to render it. Could not take a little bit more time, but it's going to look a lot more natural. Uh, actually, going back, and I select the water, go to page properties. Uh, sorry, I go to volumetrics here and double click on uh, the water and here I going to give it some refraction it uh, don't matter how uh, very much a little bit is in, is more than enough and uh, we see this look a lot more like natural water uh, there is probably uh, people also here it can help me 
see you get the water more perfect than this. But you have a clue here how it's going to be. Now you see this water. I'm not going to render it uh, now. I'm actually going to add another collision objects. I make it a lot more smaller and I'm going to move it down a little bit here I think would be fine and I can do calculate to be sure that the animation is running right. Okay. We can stop someplace here and render it. Uh, now we can uh, try to to make the water drops uh, smaller, maybe a lot more smaller, try to render it again, that's better, and I'm also going to stretch it while they are falling. And I'm going to increase the birth rate a lot. See if this make any difference. Okay, I increase it even more. What I also see is I can decrease the size of the emitter. Maybe 0.5 meters. And what's happening is that the boxes where the water comes out from is getting much smaller, about half the size. you see the water is being a little bit more natural. Uh, you can see here that the water is very um, not smooth but in reality it's uh, very naturally because water is running very fast most of the time so you don't see it but if you try it in uh, slow motion you will see more like try to do it even smaller. So now I'm going to render this as a movie. Um, go to camera. I have the camera on another uh, screen and when I move it, it becomes like that. Uh, I have one particle blur, bit red is okay. And in the render globals, I have to give it a name. I like quick time movie. Our option is okay. Uh, if you don't uh, want to see the background and you want to create an alpha channel, you can use this million color press, but else you can just leave it without the press. Uh, I need to give it a name. As you see, I have tried several times before. Yeah, and then I start 
render C. Yes, there my movie is rendering finish. Then Now I thought we could 